Hello everyone, and welcome back to Spiritual Astrology. Today I wanted to talk to you all about the first video in my series for Pluto. <clears throat> Pluto conjunct the Sun. So instead of going through the signs, like Pluto and Aries, Taurus, Gemini, Cancer, which would be ridiculous because most people alive today are like only... There's only a few signs that Pluto could have been in if you were born within the last hundred years. Anyway, Pluto takes like 200 years to go through the signs. So when it conjuncts the sun, you are intense. Like if you were born with Pluto conjunct the sun, say like my cousin and my uh, uh, someone I know in Scorpio because... A lot of the people coming into adulthood right now have Pluto and Scorpio, which is like a natural placement. I have it. Um, so do like so does everyone in my in the decade that I've been <laughs> like alive as an adult. I've talked to a lot of people that have like most people I meet because of the age group that I'm in and people I'll connect with will have Pluto and Scorpio, so we are intense, and we're pretty straightforward, and kind of, like, when it came to adulthood, and puberty, and sex, we kind of knew things before we were, like, we didn't have to be sensitive about the topic, we were kind of like, yeah, this is what it is, duh, so at the time when we were being taught all of this in school it was an extremely strange thing for us because we kind of just assumed that everyone knew without having to necessarily explain anything so there's a kind of like a basic understanding of what it means to grow up and like become an adult in a an especially like intimate way with another human being like we understand that this is a natural thing which is really important, like, it's something that you have to accept. Now, if you have something else in your chart that interferes with this Pluto conjunct the Sun, there's going to be, like, psychological issues, because pl where Pluto is, and it's conjunct your Sun, you're going to struggle with depression, because everything you feel is extremely intense. So, you're going to have to... You're going to have to moderate, like, how you express yourself in a sense, because people are... The people I've met with Pluto Conjunct the Sun are quite intimidating. Like, you're kind of... It just seems like you're angry all the time. And these are... Like, if you know someone with the Sun in Scorpio Conjunct Pluto, which is probably the most likely of the people watching this, you know how intense your emotions can be, you know how... Your life can kind of feel like it's... Like, in a way, I Pluto, the people that I know with Pluto conjunct the sun are so blessed, yet they are somehow always plagued with really intense things happening in their life. Like, there's going to be father issues, I've noticed. Usually, like, mystery around the father... Or maybe, like, something to do with that. Or, like, sexual abuse at a young age. Or, you know, bisexuality. Or homosexuality. Or pansexuality. There's going to be some sort of, like, connection there. Everything is going to be, like, really... You're going to see a rabbit hole in every situation in your life. And you're going to have to go down it. You're going to have to go to extremes from time to time just to express yourself. You're going to feel like you're, you're, you're not fully expressing yourself unless you're going to the extreme. Unless you mean something 100%. Like, it's black and white. There's no other way about it. Um, Pluto conjunct the sun. It's not... Like, I, I'm making it sound pretty bad, but I would rather have Pluto conjunct the sun than what I have now, Saturn conjunct the sun. Because Pluto and the Sun kind of have an intensity of, like, loving life. Like, if you have Pluto conjunct the Sun, you have the capacity to really live on the edge and enjoy life to its fullest extent. 
So, you know, enjoy everything that you have because that's the only way that you can express yourself is by going to the extreme, going to the limit. Um, trusting your instincts. At least follow them just to see the results. I feel like that will be important because, in a, in, like, in a major way, people with Sun conjunct Pluto are fated. Their life is fated. It's like, basically, you should surrender and let go. And then once you do that, you'll see how amazing and blessed your life truly is. Alright, thank you for watching. Bye.